What's wrong with Short Circuit 2? That's a white actor. They use brown face makeup. Like the Pop Chips commercial? Is Mindy Kaling real? Don't worry, Mindy Kaling is real. However, I was just equally shocked when I found out that the Indian guy in Short Circuit 2 was played by a white actor by the name of Fisher Stevens. This film was just one of many examples of how Hollywood has the ongoing problem of whitewashing their characters. Another example is Mickey Rooney's role as Mr. Yunioshi in Breakfast at Tiffany's. But what is whitewashing? Well, there's more than one definition for it. But whitewashing can be defined as the whitening through casting of a character who was originally a person of color in historical or source material. It can also be the casting of a white actor to play a character of color and the use of makeup, acting, and other affectations, editing, and narrative to draw on racial attributes. And such a practice is often referred to as yellow, brown, or blackface. So another question you may be asking is, why is this a problem? Why should anyone care? Well, it's a problem because it's a removal of the opportunity for marginal groups to be represented properly, to include culture, social experience, identity, and history. Such roles are damaging to the marginal community. This has started as early as 1915 in The Birth of a Nation, and it can be found in movies like The Conqueror, where John Wayne plays the role of Genghis Khan. Examples of whitewashing can be found in modern-day movies, such as Emma Stone's role as Alison Eng in Aloha, where she's supposedly a quarter Hawaiian. This place has a lot of mana. That's Hawaiian. I know what it means, Captain. It's power and spirit. Mm. Mm. Scarlett Johansson can be found playing a cyber warrior in the movie Ghosts in a Shell. Founding president of Media Action Network for Asian Americans, Guy Aoki, responded saying that many in Japan have been so brainwashed by Western culture that they developed an inferiority complex about their own. They assume that in order for an American film to be successful, it has to star a white actor. We all know that's not true. And it's a very frustrating situation when white actors are readily accorded the few roles that Asian Americans can act considering how hard it can be for those minority groups to be cast in the film industry. The Hollywood production is always at ease, ignoring the lack of Asian American representation in leading roles. We are made of matter and nothing more. You're just another tiny, momentary speck within an indifferent universe. You think too little of yourself. Oh. Yes, yes we do, Tilda. We do think too little of ourselves because you're taking all of the Asian Americans' roles. Makes you weak, makes you vulnerable. Let's look at things on the bright side. The Hellboy reboot originally casted Ed Screen to play Ben Daimyo. However, the actor decided to step down after a public outcry about Hollywood whitewashing yet another Asian character. In a public statement made by Screen, he stated that he was unaware that the original character in the comics was of mixed Asian heritage when he accepted the role. Due to Screen's mixed heritage, he understood the significance of representing the character as culturally accurate and that neglecting the responsibility would obscure ethnic minority stories and voices in the arts. The studio has since recast the role to Daniel Day Thanks, Kim. Keep that promise. You're welcome. Hopefully, we'll see more progress in Hollywood. For the first time in 25 years, we're seeing an all-Asian cast in the movie Crazy Rich Asians to come out in August of 2018. Boy, am I glad that they didn't whitewash any of the roles in this movie. Cut, 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 cut. Hold on. Um, there's something going on with this scene that's just not quite right. What's there's something about your face. What there's about my just... face? This doesn't have that Hollywood star quality. Yeah, I've been directing here for a long time, and it's just the face. Can we get the other guy in here? Yes, you. You guys yeah. had this guy just ready? Just... Yeah, him. Security, could you, could you get this guy? Yeah, him. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, security, can we get the, whoever this, whoever this guy is, let's get him out of here. That doesn't even make sense. Yeah, yes. Yes, I, I like that a lot. And action. 